Do you know what continental drift is? If not, continue watching this video. If you do know what it is, still continue watching this video. Continental drift is the movement of Earth's continents caused by seafloor spreading. 300 million years ago, all land masses collided together to form a huge continent called Pangaea. Through millions of years, these pieces of land masses drifted apart from each other to form land masses we see today. There are three strong arguments to, to support this theory. The first part of the theory is supported by the fact that fossils from before the time of continents splitting are found on separate continents. Had these continents been together at one point, these fossils would have been found in the same region. Secondly, mountains of similar form and age are found on separate continents. Again, had these continents been put together at one point, these mountains would have been in the same area. Finally, you can see the puzzle piece shaping of continents and how once they could have been together. The man who thought of this theory was Alfred Wegener in 1912. However, his precursor was Abraham Ortelius, who first formulated his theory in 1596. Wegener's theory was widely ridiculed by other scientists at first. The reason why it was ridiculed was because Wegener could not prove why and how the continents could move. After his death on an expedition to Greenland, a, scienti a scientist named Harry Heese found about Wegener's theory and then started working on how to prove his theory. He then created the seafloor spreading theory, which was then proven to be true and known as seafloor spreading, and it is used and studied throughout the world. Continental drift is a never-ending process and is still occurring today.